But first, we are following breaking news on Sao Padre Island. The Coast Guard is out searching for a missing swimmer. Channel 5's Rudy Midell has just arrived on the island. Rudy, what do you know? Well, Christine, uh, we are under red flag conditions here at South Padre Island. That means heavy surf dangerous currents. And as you can see behind me over here, we have multiple rescue units, search and rescue units from um, several agencies. We have the city of South Padre Island. We have county search and rescue, and we have federal uh, federal search and rescue teams from the U.S. Coast Guard Station here in South Padre Island as well. And I'm going to get Karina to kind of pan over to the right to see if she can get a shot of the search and rescue plane and their search and rescue vessel over over there. Now, from what we know so far, according to Nikki Soto, public information officer, it was a 26 year old male who weigh, or weighs approximately 130 pounds and stands at five foot six inches that was reported missing at about 312 this afternoon. She says all units responded almost instantly to come down here. The search began actually in front of the Seabreeze condominiums about a mile south of where we are, just uh, just north of the Wana Wana uh, bar over here on South Padre Island. Now, Again, uh, the search started at 312, and it was when two other swimmers were able to make it to shore, fighting those uh, dangerous currents in the surf here on the island. And when they got back, they noticed their friend wasn't back and immediately called uh, for search and rescue operations. Now, this story is developing, and we're hoping to get more details as they come. And as always, we will bring them to you as we get them. Live in South Padre Island, Rudy Mireles, Channel 5 News at 6.